our truth for gentle souls. Number five, I think it's important to realize that no matter how good you are to people, it doesn't necessarily mean that they will be good to you. You don't need to keep exposing yourself to unsafe people to prove how kind and compassionate you are. Number four, remember manipulation is when they blame you for your reaction to their disrespect. You don't have to shift your boundaries just to keep the peace. Number three, as Nakia Homer says, you are not lazy, unmotivated, or stuck. After years of living in survival mode, you are exhausted. There's a difference. If you're feeling stuck, focus on one small step that you can complete in the next 24 hours to help you move forward. This could be as simple as finding the courage to make a phone call that you have been avoiding. Number two, people who lie to themselves won't be honest with you either. Tell a lie once and all of your truths become questionable. Remember, truth is the basis of all healing. Number one, it's important to respect your own boundaries by choosing not to overshare with people who don't have your best interest at heart. Learn to distinguish who deserves an explanation, who deserves an answer, and who deserves absolutely nothing. Bon appetit. Five hard truths.